Hey y'all, I'm unboxing this. It's a big surprise. I got it. I got it um a couple of days ago. I paid a hundred and eighty-seven dollars. So you get here real quickly. It did before Christmas Eve because they said we'll come Christmas Eve. I got it from Fanatics. Everybody don't be tripping it. Why are you a trader? No, I'm not a trader. I just like just this. So everybody ready? Let's unbox it. I've opened it already, but I messed up the last video. So here it is. Put it on here. The new wait, I didn't say it show it. Hold on. New York Yankees jersey. Look at that. There it is. Now let me show y'all the tags on it. So this is a flex base jersey. This is the uh, last of the authentic. Uh, no, this is authentic jersey, but this is the last of the majestic jerseys because the Nike one is really already out. I saw what it looked like, but they haven't selling it yet. Yeah, they are selling it. And it has that swoosh already on it. I really don't like that. This is a flex base jersey. Here's the tags. And got this for Fanatics. This is a size 44. Now my Dodgers jersey is a 48. Remember that was a, that's a long jersey, but I saw broke down. I got the 44 for this. Oh, yep. Let me show y'all. This is from Fanatics. This is Fanatic Cash thing you get and stuff. So now I'm going to put it on a hanger and y'all can really see the authentic of it. And, and there's the uh, MLB logo. Oh, and here's something that I didn't get. Well, I'll show y'all when I put it on the hanger. Hold on. Okay, there it goes. There it is. Look at that. New York Yankees jersey. Now we're going to do the breakdown of this jersey. Now, here's your cool flex right here on the side. Ooh, see? See how that is? That's the cool part of it right there. It's on the side to make it cool and stuff. Then you have this, this part. And on the thing, it says U.S. patent. Now, I wonder if the Nike one going to have this. So now here's the thing I'm gonna show y'all. Well, oh well, here's the majestic sleeve. Nike should have put theirs on the sleeve instead of putting it right there. They should have put it on the sleeve and just put it right. That would have been cooler. Now here's the one my Dodger jersey doesn't have. All, all the MLB players wore this this season was this. I didn't get this, but my Dodger jersey was 2015. This is 2019. So I never got this one. Well, you know, it's 150 year. Of baseball so all baseball players had this so the authentic ones got this so check that it's cool and they go that yankee sign and yeah it's wrong for them to put that they could have put their swoosh right there on the arm they did it for the nfl because the nfl jerseys their their swoosh is on the on their arm so that should have been done for the baseball teams now hold on let me turn it around and here's the back of it See this? You got this thing right here. Stuff. I gotta find a cover, a plastic cover. Yeah, here's like I said, your like space papers, the breakdown of it. U.S. patent of our park. 
Yeah, cool flex. You see on the Dodger one, you kind of can see this good. On this one, you see a little bit of it, like right there. So what they're talking about, the Dodger one is like much wider. And uh, flexible lightweight. Now there, this thing like this jersey much lighter than the Dodger. Dodger one has a little bit more weight to it. Flexible, cool. Yeah. When I buy this, I buy this stuff from Fanatics. That's where you get your real jersey. Stop going to eBay. Pay some real money. Size 44. Then there you go. MLB. See, there's some black and white. The, uh, some are different colors. I know the one on the Dodger one is the red. Is it blue? Something. I forgot the color. I'll have to check it again. So that's your MLB logo. Right there. And this is what I'm happy about because I am shocked. But I now realize the breakdown of white illustration because this has been 150 years. So, so they got this implanted in it. Let's turn it back around. And they go the see. This is when you know it's real a real jersey because um regulars and replicas they only have they have the size. But the authentic on all jerseys of all sports teams and all all teams, period, it always has this number 44, 52, all the way up. So this one this time I bought a 44. We're gonna see how long it is and stuff when I put this on. And this is an authentic jersey. Look at that. Because even the real MLB players will used to have the same this on it. So you know. And when it comes to authentic jerseys and for teams, I think baseball is really getting the same. They, baseball players nearly getting the same thing as what regular people are getting. It's the same authentic jersey. So it's like you wearing the same clothes that they're wearing on the field. Because NBA ones, they're authentic, but they're their uh, patches be always different. Same, they'll say the number, but it'd be all different. I know Reebok and Adidas, their, their things said the number, but the uh, tag for the NBA player itself, when they were wearing a jersey on the court, it was always different from what you bought from the store. So that's why I say, oh, shoot. Look at your buttons. They buttoned it up when I bought it, so it's all the way buttoned up. Stop. And look, oh, let's look at the inside. Taking the camera inside the jersey. No one ever looks inside. So there's the next space behind the little tail thingy. Behind. Let's see what else is inside. Oh, there's something. What is that? Can I get to it without making it fall? I think this is the washing tag. I'm going to tell y'all I take all my authentic stuff to the cleaners. I don't wash this stuff. I don't wash my expensive jersey. Take it to the cleaners. It's size 44. Inside tag, if I can get back to it again. I had it in my hand. There we go. It tells you how to wash it, but like I said, I'm not trustworthy of washing something like this. <laughs> oh, what was that? There was something else on it. Oh, 37 on the button. So, there it is. Jinky's jersey. Hold on, let me pull this thing out. See, there it go. There you go. Yankees jersey in LA. And yeah, I will wear this in public. You tell people I'm not a traitor. I just like their jersey. Like other baseball players. Baseball players like the Yankees jersey in the way of looking the pinstripes. There's nothing wrong with that. So, there you go. So, I know y'all gonna comment and everything. Go ahead and make y'all comments and... Ask the questions that you want to ask about it and the size and everything. I don't mind. So this is the unboxing of it.
Oh, I know people wonder why have I aimed it like this? This is a teaching thing. When you do unbox something, always keep it on there for maybe a minute or two, maybe a minute, because then you have a really a good thumbnail. This is really going to become a good thumbnail the way I have it just pointed right here at this length of time. So when people click on it, they're like, wow. Because I didn't really do a good job when I did my Dodger one. So, and that's it.